from manuals, documents, contracts to even books are digital now and these mostly come in the form of PDF. PDFs are very easy to share and to work with for both professional and personal usage. You can view PDFs from your laptop, PC or mobile phones. Also PDF files are trusted file formats as it's widely used. You can view this using a browser, specific app or even word processors. But it's limited when it comes to editing. So let's talk about this amazing app that helps you with editing PDFs which is called PDF Element. If you are into administrative works and working with documents, this app has some amazing tools that you must know. It's available for both Mac and Windows which I'll leave link in the description. So let's talk about some of the awesome things that we can do with this app. On the startup screen you have all the recent files or you can open any PDF files from your computer to start editing. Now let's move on to these tools which is the main highlight of this app. First is the select tool. With this you can copy the text on PDFs and then paste it anywhere you want. Very handy when you want to copy contents from a PDF file and then paste it somewhere else. Then we have the hand mode. Nothing special with this tool but it makes scrolling between the pages quite easy. Uh, very handy while going through long PDFs. Next is edit text. As the name implies this helps you to edit the text on your PDFs. And the best part is this tool is so smart that it automatically identifies the font and its properties as per your document to match the PDF content as you can see here. For example, if I edit the title on this PDF, it automatically adapts the properties of this title font. This is an amazing tool and is very helpful in many cases like editing office documents where you need to quickly edit or fix your PDF. Then we have edit image mode. This can be used to resize or rearrange the images on any PDFs. Perfect for documents like instructions or manuals. Next is Edit Link. It auto-analyzes the hyperlinks on the documents and allows us to edit them as well. All the tools I talked about can be accessed from the tab on the left also. Similarly on the right we have info on the number of pages, you can see your bookmarks or leave a comment. These tools are handy for presentations and ebooks just in case you want to bookmark some pages or important stuff. Then we have some preview options like you can zoom in the pages, zoom out etc. We also have the option to organize pages, remove or add pages, or even insert another PDF to an existing PDF to merge contents. Very handy for ebook users or for presentations. Moreover, we have tools like highlighting the text, and here you also get the option to choose the highlight color. You can add text box, you can underline the text, you can add shapes, comments, add sticky notes just in case if you want to remind yourself for something or even word meanings while reading ebooks. You also have the option to add stamps and even your signature. All this really enhances the user experience. All in all this is the best PDF editor I have come across and is great for all of those who are working with PDF files, documentation and administrative works. So that was it for this video guys, I hope you found something useful here. Feel free to leave your comments down below and stay tuned for upcoming contents. I will catch you guys in the next one.